Hey, what's up everybody? This is Carlos, also known as C as the Director, coming to you with another figure review. This time, we have Grimlock from the studio series, the Ta Takara Tommy, um, Age of Extinctions, um, the Dinobot. So here we have Grimlock. Um, so let's check them out and, and let's see this figure. It is very, very beautiful. Um, so before I get into it, this is the box. I'm sure you guys have seen it everywhere online so you got a picture of Grimlock in the back you have what he looks like in his dino mode and that's what he looks like out of it and other figures and display all that good stuff you got Grimlock again you got a number seven on the side so that pretty much covers that on the box um, let's get into the figure itself this figure right here it is very very movie accurate and I gotta say it's very impressive it is wow there's no words to describe it this is what we were waiting for this is what I was waiting for you know it's like I'm sure there's a lot of you guys that can agree and wow this figure is amazing so here you have them look at that that's beautiful that this is just I'm speechless it, it's it's incredible the details it is just on point like on every angle it is amazing um th this is the figure that i was waiting for so before we get into like a little bit of more details i want to just kind of do a quick basic run through um i'm not gonna do the dino mode um at least to show you the whole transformation just because of time's sake um but i want you guys to see what the figure itself looks like and pretty much let's do the size comparison so this is the new one and this is grimlock from age of extinction or i think it was the yeah the last night that they just brought them out again um this is the voyager so you can see the size comparison you know you have wow it's like completely different this was an actual nice re-release um so that's the voyager just so you can see the size and then here he is next to the leader class this was the platinum series um the, the one that comes in the two pack with um optimus so you can see they're almost into scale but you can see the difference between both of them you have this one that's like wow look at the details on this this was nice don't get me wrong that's why i got it um huge fan of that one also it's just it wasn't very movie accurate you know you guys know about it so that's that and of course i have the one that came out the first one of the series um from grimlock so you can see size comparison the details what i miss about this one is all the chrome i'm huge i i love the chrome details on these but um this is what we got so this is amazing i'm talking about this figure is just incredible on every every detail aspect it is phenomenal it's look at the details on that look at that that t-rex face those teeth the teeth they're like a soft rubber real soft i guess they do it because they don't want kids to get hurt or anybody to get hurt the, the spike horn in the top it's like a soft rubber also His hand does not come out. It doesn't come off. Um, of course, you have all these right here. Articulation-wise, I guess you get your standard stuff. Um, it's the same thing we always get, but maybe a little bit more. Um, I don't want to kind of like mess up the joints. I know some people are like extreme when they do their reviews. Not me. I like to collect them and keep them in, in very like collector mode, if you want to say. Um, but it's a fantastic I'm talking about I'm, I'm so impressed I'm, I'm like speechless the color the detail oh, this is just this is incredible you know like this was the figure that I wanted since I saw this from this movie from the Bayverse if you want to call it just it, it's just incredible you know it's like wow like it's just words can't describe now do I suggest to get it 
that's really up to you. I got it because I, I liked it. I'm a huge fan of Grimlock, at least in the movie, and I, I couldn't pass on this on this figure. So that's why I got it. It's very beautiful. It's very movie accurate. Um, if you collect Transformers, you will be you'll be happy with this figure. So let's see where he stands about, just to have the idea. So here we have, there you guys can see. Sorry if you can't see the full details. He stands about right here where the horn is at, the top about 10, 10 inches. So it's not bad, it's a little under 10, but it's a nice height for the figure itself. But again, here we have Grimlock next to the Voyager class. And then we have him next to the leader class. So that's not bad at all. It's really nice. And I'm glad that we got this figure because I mean, why not? You know, it's like, it's about time we got this figure the right way. And I'm very happy with it. Well worth it. They're under, well, if you get it online at a good deal, you might get them under, they're running under like 80 bucks. There he is next to Optimus. Which to me, that's a little more movie accurate. Next to the Voyager Optimus. So again, it's a beautiful figure. I suggest you highly get it. I recommend it. And if you're a fan of Grimlock, of this version of the Dinobot, why not get it? And of course in the box you have the whole diorama where you have the whole exploding China scene. So let me pop that open so you guys can see instead of me talking. I know you guys are just show me. Let's take a look, just bear with me. All right, so here we have this nice background. And if you want to place them, you can place them right there. Or like that. However you like. But that's nice that we got this bonus included with it. It would have been nice if he would have brought accessories, if you can remove the mace, um, this big spike ball joint, whatever you want to call it, um, and put one of his hands and how we got on the Voyager if we would have got you know his spike mace weapon that would have been nice but I am not complaining I know there's gonna be a lot of people like talking oh but this and oh this is not right hey we got it that's all I wanted and I want to say thanks to Hasbro because you guys gave us what we want at a reasonable price and this is incredible this is fantastic great job and I hope we get more um, from the line. I do have Blackout and I will be reviewing him. So again, if you like my content, content um, make sure to support it. Hit that like, the share, uh, thumbs up, thumbs down. It's all good. Uh, leave your thoughts, your comments, um, all that good stuff. I mean, you know, let's interact, show some love, show some feedback. Um, I do this for you guys and of course to share my passion. Um, but yeah. So, hope you guys enjoyed it, and till next time, if you want to see uh, me review him as in the Dinobot mode, let me know. Um, sorry I did not get into it, because it's just time six, it's just, it, it's really long, so, um, but yeah, so leave your comments below, and again, thanks for watching.